Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do the daily vibes for around the 15th, but we all know that the timing is fluid. I just completed all the week ahead readings for February 15th through the 21st if you want to check them out. There's a playlist created for that. I did also complete the March readings for each sign. You could find those in a playlist. Just want to let you know I do have uh, window um, barriers coming at the end of February. Uh, yeah, let's see what comes up. What do we have for a message today? If you'd like to book a private readings at reading, I do have a few slots open. You can find the link in the description box of every video. What do we have for a message today for the upcoming energy? King of Swords reversed. Now the King of Swords reversed is a ruthless individual who is probably not making a very informed decision. This is somebody that is, they could be abusive, this could be a bully, this is somebody that is uh, not seeing something clearly, could be upset, um, power hungry. We may have somebody here that is, is, is hungry for power. You know, they want power. Making a decision. Somebody is definitely making a choice right now. They are making a choice. They, they, they got to do something. I'm not sure it's the, a wise decision, though, with the King of Swords reversed. This is somebody that may be acting out of anger. Uh, they are making a decision. This could also, if you want to go down another route, when we have the King of Swords reverse, this could be somebody that has been not following their heart. So we may have somebody here that is seeing clearly that they need to follow their heart. So that's another whole scenario. It is. So we may have somebody here that is deciding, you know, to follow their heart after they have only been listening to some poor advice or they haven't been very logical or they made a poor decision in the past. Obviously somebody has made a poor decision in the past. Now they see clearly perhaps that they have. So this could be somebody that is changing their mind. But this person is seems, I mean, typically the King of Swords in reverse is somebody that is ruthless you know, and uncaring, but it can be the opposite where this person starts to follow their heart. Mm -hmm. Ah, this is about uh, give and take. It's about generosity. It's about getting what they deserve, about receiving what they deserve. It's about um, equality. So somebody may be wanting some balance. They may be wanting to give something. Maybe they weren't seeing clearly in the past. Maybe they were confused. They were in some sort of illusionary state of mind. They may have made a poor decision. I do feel like somebody's made a poor decision. Now they're going to be... Um, they want balance. Somebody wants balance. Ooh, but the Eight of Wands reversed is lack of movement. Um, maybe jealousy issues. There could be some jealousy issues here. There could be, obviously, there, I feel like somebody has received some poor advice. I feel like somebody has received some poor advice from another person and they may have they may have made a choice based on somebody else's opinion and now they're now they're I don't know now they're wanting something else that's what it feels like to me um, maybe they realize there's no success in that choice that they made what is this king of swords doing um, they haven't been logical and they try, thought they were being logical, but they, made, they, they got themselves in a, in a false beginning here. They made a poor choice. Somebody made a poor choice. Three of Wands, reverse, wasted time. Things not working out. Somebody, it feels like somebody's been waiting for something to happen, and it's not working out. This is lack of foresight. Somebody didn't see. They didn't see something clearly, but it feels like... Now they haven't been receiving, they didn't receive what they thought they were going to get. 
and they've wasted some time because they made a poor choice. Somebody has wasted time. They have wasted time. And, they, and it's because they, they went in the wrong direction. Somebody went in the wrong direction. And it's because they just didn't see and they missed an opportunity. Somebody missed an opportunity because they, were, they weren't following their heart. Ah, and a decision is being made right now. A decision is definitely being made right now. This is somebody that is really, really thinking that has gained some sort of life experience. They've been blocking. They've been blocking something that they deserve. So somebody has been blocking something. But it feels like they've gained some sort of life experience. And now they're making a better decision for everybody involved. We have somebody here that is, is taking responsibility. They are taking responsibility after they didn't see something clearly. They didn't. This is somebody that really tried to make a decision, but they weren't thinking clearly. But now it feels like they are. It may have something to do with a father figure or a business owner or a boss or somebody that is in a position of authority that is definitely taking ownership, taking charge, trying to bring structure and order to a situation. This is somebody that is going to be making a decision that is definitely best for more than just themselves. They haven't had success with whatever choice they made in the past. It didn't turn out successful. And they may, be, they may have gotten angry. You know, they wasted time. And I feel like they see it clearly that they, they made a poor decision. Somebody sees it very, very clearly. And now they're making another choice. And they're going to be giving something. You know, they're going to be reciprocating. They want balance. Ooh, ooh, magician reverse. And the magician reversed is somebody, this is a very trick, this is a trickster. This is somebody that is uh, manipulative. There's some sort of manipulation here. There's There's been some sort of manipulation or lies or something like that. Somebody's been lying or manipulating or... Um, they may have had some hidden agendas. Somebody may have been dealing with somebody that had hidden agendas. You know, they may have been dealing with a trickster that was manipulating them. And that caused this person to waste time and not see. Somebody was manipulated by another person. This person gave them poor advice. And that is exactly what I see. And it was because this person is, is miserable. Anyway... Um, magician reversed is not taking action. Somebody did not see. They were not aware. They were totally not aware that they were being manipulated by another person. And they chose, they chose the wrong path. They chose the wrong option. They did. They absolutely did. But now they're seeing very, very clearly that they chose the wrong option. They are. And they're about to make a decision. They are about to make a decision based on, you know, some sort of receiving some sort of information. I feel like they've received or they've received experience or something or they've thought about it. This is somebody that has thought about the choices that they have made. Hmm. Four of Cups. Somebody's missed an opportunity. They have. They ignored an opportunity for love. They missed an opportunity. They did. They, it's right here and right here. Because of, of manipulation. Somebody was tricked. Somebody was tricked. Or they, or they were just given poor advice by an individual that is very cold. Maybe they were given, in, given advice from an individual that isn't very skilled. This person is cold, cold-hearted, abusive, manipulative. Somebody was manipulated. Absolutely. 
But now, now they see very, very clearly that they were lied to. They see that they were lied to. They see that they made a poor choice. And I feel like they, they wasted time. They missed an opportunity. And they're probably, I feel like we should get the nine of cups here. Because I feel like this person is wishing. I feel like they're wishing. They're hoping. They're hoping and wishing that they didn't, you know, that they could have another chance. Anyhow, um, somebody just was not aware. They thought they were making the right decision, and I feel like they're having regrets. They are having regrets. Ah, Three of Swords reversed. Now that is forgiveness. Yeah, somebody may be wanting forgiveness. They, they probably hurt another person really, 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 really badly. They stabbed somebody in the heart, and I feel like this is this is heartache. This is this is wanting to heal. Somebody may want to heal. They may be taking action to heal. They may be trying to heal something, something that they ignored in the past, something you know that they uh, chose not to invest in. It feels like this is this is there's a chance for healing. This is there's a, there's a chance to heal something. Somebody wants a chance to heal. This is the end of suffering. You know, somebody has been suffering. They may may they may want to heal something, but they haven't been able to take action. They haven't been able to. They haven't taken any action as of yet because, you know, they they could be disgraced. They could be embarrassed. You know. Um, and it will take a lot of strength. It will take a lot of strength and courage to take action. But I feel like we have somebody here that hasn't been able to communicate or they haven't been able to take action. And I think it's because of pride. I do think it's because of pride. And I feel a loss of power here. Somebody is feeling powerless. You know, they're feeling powerless because they wasted time. You know, it's like, oh my God, I wasted so much time. I'm so stupid. I shouldn't have done that. You know, that's how I feel. I, I wish that I could give. You know, I wish that I could give back. And I feel like they are going to give, but I feel like they want to heal, you know, and there is a there is a path to recovery here, but it will it will take a lot of courage and it will take a lot of strength to do the right thing. So anyhow, um, somebody has wasted a lot of time and they lost an opportunity for love by the looks of things. Anyhow, this is on the path to recovery, though. This is healing with the three of, three of Swords reversed. Healing after there's been a lot of pain. So there is an opportunity to heal, but we have an individual that just hasn't found the resources within them to communicate or take action because, and I think it's because of pride, but they want to. I feel like they want to. And um, this person has abused their power in the past. They have. Um... And they definitely made a poor choice. They definitely did. They chose based on illusion or on, you know, somebody else's advice. I feel like somebody received advice from an individual that wasn't very experienced or was bitter or something like that. And, you know, or had their own agenda, you know. And now they're regretting it. I think they are regretting it. Um... Hangman. So this is sacrificing, uh, having a hard time doing the right thing, seeing things from a new perspective. So we definitely have somebody here that has been thinking a lot. They have been thinking a lot. They've been thinking about communicating. They've been thinking about somebody that they hurt really, really badly. They probably do want to heal, but it's going to take a real uh, strong individual to do that. This is somebody that needs to take ownership. And they know that they need to take ownership. So anyway, I feel like somebody's been trying to punish another person as well. You know, by not communicating, by not going in that direction. But now maybe they've become enlightened or they are becoming enlightened. Somebody has, has or they're evolving. They are evolving. Somebody has a golden opportunity right now to heal something, but it will require communication. It will. Um, but they're having a hard time because of their ego. And this is ego and pride. It absolutely is. Trying to prove something. Somebody has been trying to prove a point, right? They have. They have the point right there. So somebody has been trying to prove a point, and, but, but it's not been making them happy, right? It hasn't been bringing them happiness trying to prove this point. 
So we have somebody here that is struggling. They are definitely struggling. They've been wasting a lot of time. They've wasted a lot of time and they're having a hard time. They're having a hard time. They're struggling to let go and uh, look at things from a new perspective. But I do feel like whoever this person is, is gaining a new perspective. But their ego is still in the way because this is ego, no communication, no moving forward. So somebody's, they're, they're, it's like they're, they're healing or they're going through a period of healing. They do realize that they made a poor choice. They know that they did and they know that they missed an opportunity. They, they didn't see that they had a, something good. They, they, they definitely didn't see it. Um, but their pride is still in the way and stopping them. It's blocking them from communicating or blocking them from moving forward. Um, but they do want to heal. But they, I feel maybe they're afraid of rejection because of this six of pentacles. That's about give and take. What if I give and I don't get anything back? So I do feel like we have somebody here that's thinking a lot. They are thinking a lot about somebody that they hurt. They are thinking about somebody that they hurt very, very badly. But they, they, they can't communicate right now because of their ego. And um, then they probably won't communicate because of their ego. Not right now. They can't take any action. They aren't taking any action to bring success even though they know. They know. Uh, what they need to do. It will take a very strong individual to for them to take action. It will take a lot of strength. It will take a lot of courage and it will take, um, you know, ownership. So anyhow, whoever this person is, they are thinking a lot about um, what they deserve and what they have to offer and what they want and what they lost out on. They're thinking about a lost opportunity. And they're thinking about the poor choices that they made. And it feels like now they've lost their power over another person. Ace of Cups. So there is an opportunity for love here. Could even be a reconciliation. Okay, the Ace of Cups is a new start in love. Things getting better. Somebody is probably dreaming about another person a lot. They're in their emotions. They're in their feelings. This is a flood of emotion. And their intuition is telling them to take action. But the moon, I mean the moon, I don't know why I said the moon. The moon isn't here. But anyway... The magician reverse is somebody that can't take action. This is somebody that is really, really struggling with the hangman. They are struggling. They are struggling to follow their heart. But their heart is, it's like they're really in their feelings. They're really feeling it. It's like they're really feeling emotional over, you know, a missed opportunity or a lost opportunity. I do feel like there is going to be an opportunity for love. There is an opportunity for love here. Absolutely there is. But it will, but it will require somebody letting go of their pride and their ego. And taking charge. Good luck.